Libyan politicians have gathered in Tunisia to discuss how to launch a new peace process. Libyans have welcomed foreign assistance but insisted on retaining the country's sovereignty and territorial integrity. CGTN's Adel Adnan Chauchi has made the latest. The Libyan General National Congress held a meeting in Tunis. Libyans warned against foreign interference in their country's internal affairs and urged for a political settlement. Some parties are blocking the political settlement, while others are calling for dialogue. The international community can support the peace process, but it should not take sides. We're in favor of a partial solution if we cannot solve the crisis. A new presidential council can be appointed to rule for the next three months. Libyans must vote on the 1st of January 2019 to elect a new leadership. Libyan officials shed light on the alarming security situation near oil fields where rival groups are fighting to control the area. The situation has become worse in Libya, especially in the oil crescent region where many factions and armed groups are taking arms. The bloodshed has just begun. Some vital and strategic facilities were either affected or destroyed and oil production has stopped. Experts added that the interruption of oil production has led to a new economic crisis in Libya. The interruption of export has cut financial resources and oil revenues. Oil is the pillar of the economy in Libya. The escalation of the armed conflict does not serve any party, faction or tribe. All Libyan citizens are losing time, money and energy. Last week, Tunisian Foreign Minister Ahmed Jhinawi held a meeting with Libyan Parliament Speaker Aqila Saleh in the Libyan city of Tobruk. Jhinawi said that Tunisia is working to advance the political process in Libya, bring the views of the Libyan stakeholders closer and provide the conditions for the achievement of the expected political milestones. Experts in Libyan affairs assert that Tunis, Cairo and Algiers are working closely with the authorities in Libya to ease tension and to resolve the political crisis. Tunisians believe that the national reconciliation is necessary in the North African state in order to turn the page on over seven years of war in Libya. Admin Shawishi, CGTN, Tunis. In South Africa,